Protesters are demanding that the courts free Britney, but why? From Reach TV Studios in Hollywood, I'm Shira Lazar, you're watching What's Trending. Be sure to like this video and subscribe for more social media news daily. Pop icon Britney Spears has had an army of loyal fans since she came onto the scene in the 90s that have stayed with her through the ups and downs of her career. In 2007, Britney hit quite the rough patch when she had a mental breakdown, leading to a legally binding conservatorship, which required her to surrender financial and lifestyle rights to an overseer. A conservatorship is meant to protect people who can't take care of themselves, but Britney is now 37 years old and fans think that, well, she can take care of herself. Fans are especially critical because the conservator, in Britney's case, is her father, Jamie Spears, which means he can control everything, from her finances to her medication. When Britney canceled her residency in Vegas a few months ago, a lot of people became worried and started poking around and found many red flags. A podcast called Britney's Graham, hosted by Barbara Gray and Tess Barker, noticed that Britney's behavior seemed a bit off. And after digging into Britney's posts and bolstering the hashtag Save Britney social campaign, they received this voicemail. Um, I used to be a paralegal for an attorney that worked um, with Britney's conservatorship. I'm no longer with them. Um, and what is happening is disturbing to say the least. But Britney continued to deny that anything was wrong and asked her fans to back off. Hi guys, just checking in with all of you who are concerned about me, all is well. My family has been going through a lot of stress and anxiety lately, so I just need a time to deal. But don't worry, I'll be back very soon. So, you know, the topic died down a bit online. That is until Kevin Federline, the father of Britney's two sons, filed a police report alleging Jamie Spears had abused one of his grandsons during a visit at his home. According to reports, he violently shook 13-year-old Sean after breaking down a bedroom door to reach him. Federline was also able to secure a restraining order against Jamie. The family went to court this week to discuss Jamie's legal relationship with Britney's sons, and the hearing resulted in insufficient proof that Jamie committed a criminal offense. Thus, he was not charged with child abuse. And while this might have been disappointing to the free Britney advocates, there are currently rumors, according to TMZ, that Britney may ask the courts not to reinstate the conservatorship in 2020. But in the meantime, both Britney and her family maintain that she is happy. I don't know, there's so many conspiracy theories here. One, did Britney go to rehab? Is Jamie, her dad, sick? Did she take a break because she was trying to connect and get her family together? Is the hashtag free Britney movement valid? Is she being held against her will? Let us know in the comments below. And be sure to like and subscribe for more of What's Trending. We're also on Instagram, at What's Trending. Follow us everywhere. Plus, we're on Roku, Amazon Fire, Apple TV. Just search What's Trending.